this is raspberry from last year. Here. So these are, are plum trees that I planted last year. Unfortunately, there was the drought uh, last spring. So I don't know if they're going to come back. But I think maybe, maybe they will come back. Um, and it, wouldn't it be nice to be walking here in the middle of, well, nearly the middle of the city and be able to uh, grab a, a one apple one day. That's what I want. <laughs> Continue. A friend of mine gave me these um, bulbs. Uh, today, okay, uh, I'm waiting for rain maybe to, to, wet the, to wet my planting, but I always uh, walk around with little tools like this. So I'm going to add a few bulbs in here and see what happens. So you, you, when you're walking around, always have maybe some um, seeds or some um, seedlings to plant on your walks and see what happens. Let's see. That's all I do, you know, and if it doesn't survive, it doesn't survive. It's not a competition, it's just a pleasure. The so you'd be amazed, um, water is needed in Ireland, and I think if you can carry a bit of water in your, in your bag as well, to give it a, a nice sprinkle for the seeds. I don't, um, I don't keep track of what I, I plant, I, I just leave things, and I, I like to walk around and see what happens. You see, this is really, really delightful. I think we're going to put the plant here, the railings. This is a good spot. Okay. You see, the, the, the ground is, is wet and here is okay. It's okay. Like they get enough. Nice. Mm. Apparently it's good for the stressed plants to get a bit of water. So I'm finished. I feel great. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work. Guerrilla uh, gardening is about throwing things in the wilderness in urban settings and see what happens if you don't help it. It's not your garden. You have to kind of let it, let the nature take over. 